How about it's Dean Godrew with me? He said, there's no business without prospecting. Oh, well, it's just the truth. I think <laughs> I, I'm a salesperson at heart, so I'm always gonna say the same thing, but I think every business is gonna succeed off, you, off the back of your ability to prospect and create leads and sales. I think yeah. that's a no-brainer. So for us in real estate, I think you have to be completely driven by your ability to prospect. Pat and I still do it to this day. We lead by example, and it's a huge part of what drives our individual businesses, yeah. as, well as, the, as well as the success of Place Ascot and Place Nunder. Yeah, so what is it? Everyone knows, like a diet, they know what they need to do, but they don't do it. You've said that drive, that, I don't know, what, what is the drive that you've got? Well, the drive for me came out of necessity, right? Because I, I was needed living, money. I, was, yeah. I needed money, I was living in a country, I didn't have any support from, um, my parents, so I, I, it came down to actually, I, I, I borrowed the last $10,000 my mum had yep. to pay rent, you know, and at 32 years old, that was not a, not a great feeling. Yep. So 30 years old, I think. So for me, it came down to just absolute necessity, and the only way I was going to get myself out of that situation, it became very clear, was to prospect, to yep. pick up the phone. phone. And, you know, when you've got the ability, you know, you see everyone else leaving the office at 5.36, yep. and you're not making money, or you stay on the phones yeah. until now, you get it done. You talked about one of your early days when you were selling units, they weren't owner occupied, so you had to get on the phone to find the Yeah, owners. so that was the, the the cloth that I was cut from, yep. right? Because I was selling one bedroom apartments, two bedroom apartments, yep. which was a huge investment market. There was no way to just rock up on the door and, and door knock these yep. guys. So it was white pages online, you would get the phone number, you would call them, typically sitting in Sydney, Melbourne, Hong Kong, all over the yep. world. And these guys are just number crunchers, right? They invest. They've got their calculator out, just seeing yeah. if it makes sense to sell it. So that really honed my skills as a, you know, whatever you want to call it, cold caller, telemarketer. Get on. The Essentially, line. telemarketing, right? Yeah. That's what we do. Done. Cheers.